In this video, I have described the process of creating macOS Sequoia bootable ISO image. I have converted the downloaded installation media from Apple website .app into ISO image. You can follow the steps as it is very simple as I used only terminal to create that ISO image. You will find the whole process described in my website itech4mac.net. Here is the, the article that describes the whole process. I will leave the, com the, the link into the comments of this video. You can open it and follow it as I have described here. Start the process. We have to move the installation app into the desktop by copying or moving it into your desktop to complete the process very easy and it moves. Just type your password and it will move to your desktop. Now open my website to get the commands that I will use into Terminal. Terminal is, a, is an app that comes with your Mac. You can find it by searching Spotlight. Write Terminal and you will find it into your desktop. Open Terminal and copy the first command to create DMG container into your desktop of a large size to Take hold the, the file of Sequoia. Now type the second command to mount this container into your drive like a USB or something like that. Just by typing this command, you will get a container opened into your desktop. Now move to the command number three. And this needs some uh, experience. Just type sudo. And right click the install macOS sequoia dot app show package content open the contents folder resources and find a file named create installation media just drag this file into your terminal after the word sudo type dash dash volume dash dash volume then drag the sequoia the container after that volume then dash dash no interaction no interaction and press enter you will have to type your mac password and you will see a sequence of processes that takes about two to three minutes to make a bootable disk into this container as shown in the screen now you have created the installation media or installation volume. The fourth command is to detach this installation media, detach this container. Just type it and it will detach this container as you can see, eject it. Now to the fifth command to convert the DMG installer to CDR container. You will find a new container Call the sequoia.cdr into your desktop. Now to the final or the last command, just convert the CDR into ISO image. Copy this command and paste it into terminal. Press start and now you will have a sequoia.iso bootable installer into your mac you can use it when with any virtual drive or virtual machines like parallel desktop and virtual box and vmware thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and visit my website itech for mac thank you